Shout to the who's who of India Inc. for their reactions when the story broke from the doyen of the Indian IT industry, NRN Moot, Narayan Murthy, to the doyen of the Indian banking sector, Deepak Parekh. But first, here is Chandrasekharan's mentor, S. Ramadurai. Sir Ramadurai, uh, good evening. Uh, uh, your first thoughts, uh, uh, almost your protégé, Chandra, has uh, taken over. No, extremely pleased that uh, they have chosen the right person. Mm. And he will do a terrific job, and I'm happy that uh, he has uh, been chosen with the right kind of qualities, with the right kind of experience, both international and domestic uh, okay. segments. And each uh, uh, system of the Tata Group will become uh, very, very good. Uh, sir, the typical way in which uh, the Tata Group is described is the software to salt conglomerate. Uh, this literally is a transition from software to steel, salt, uh, salt uh, uh, motor cars, autos, chemicals, uh, uh, just the entire range. Can Chandra make that transition? Absolutely. When you look at the client across uh, segments of the industry, the kind of depth and the continuity with the interaction with the chairman, the CEOs, the operating uh, managers, CEOs, yeah, all of this, when you combine, it's an announcement. It's an extremely good uh, selection. And mm -hmm. uh, one is able to pick up a lot of things. Yeah, he's operationally one of the soldiers in the world. They are talking about it. I think mm -hmm. he'll pick it up very quickly. Okay. We've also got Mr. N. R. Narayana Murthy, the co-founder of Infosys, joining us. Mr. Murthy, thanks very much for joining us. Let me just tell you, sir, that we have now established contact with a board member of Tata Sons, a board member confirming to us what we broke several hours ago, that N. Chandrasekharan will be the new chairman of Tata Sons. Your first reactions, Mr. Murthy? Well, I think it's a big honor for the IT industry. Chandra is a great role model for all of us. He is the leader of the number one company in our industry. He has demonstrated stellar qualities as a leader. He is a simple human being. He is austere. He is very confident. He is very pleasant. He leads by example. And he is a great leader of men and women. And I think his choice, in my opinion, is going to be a great choice because he's all the time learning. He's all the time watching people. He's all the time learning from others. He's all the time sharing his knowledge with others. I have had personally very, very pleasant interactions with him and uh, he and his wife, you know, they are, they, are, they, are, they are great human beings. I have met both of them and I have no doubt at all that the entire industry would be celebrating today. You believe the entire industry will be celebrating today. But Mr. Murthy, uh, you know, Chandra now faces an arduous task of trying to steer this large conglomerate, which is going through fairly difficult times. Uh, what do you see, and I was just asking Mr. R. Chandrasekhar, the president of NASCOM, who's also with us, what do you see as being the big challenge that he will have to cope with and contend with? Well, you know, uh, the reality is simply this, that Tatas are in, uh, from, uh, you know, uh, ships to, to, to fish. They are, they are in uh, airlines, they are in steel, they are in software. They are in a multiplicity of industry. But let's remember one thing. The essence of leadership is the ability to raise the confidence of his or her people. It is the ability to make them do extraordinary things. It is the ability to lead by example. It is the ability to, to, to raise the confidence of people. And uh, therefore, I personally think, knowing Chandra as I do, uh, he will be in a position to instill in, and inspire people, you know, leaders of various other uh, companies through his own example. I think that is what is needed, at, you know, and uh, he will do it uh, eminently. 
Uh, Mr. Murthy, you know, for Rajesh Gopinath, who now takes over at TCS, and of course we've been discussing how TCS is a, uh, is a stable, well-settled uh, organization, but uh, uh, even for Rajesh, uh, you know, the IT services business is seeing difficult times, uncertain times, given the fact that you have Donald Trump in the White House shortly. Uh, what do you see as being the big challenge for Rajesh, uh, Mr. Murthy? You know, un unfortunately, I don't know Rajesh, therefore, it is not possible for me to talk about Rajesh. I wish I knew him. I have no doubt that he too is a great leader because when when uh, the board of Tata uh, Consultancy Services has chosen has chosen Rajesh, he must be a great leader. I wish him the best of uh, everything. But the challenges are very, very clear, and that is how do you reduce your dependence on visa? How do you create... Uh, uh, distinctive competitive advantage? How do you take market share from your competitors? How do you demonstrate, uh, you know, your uniqueness in a market that is not growing as fast as you can? How do you make yourself multicultural? Well, that's